that of the agent conversation with your customers be able to prepare some files that you will be able to attach later to your customers and send emails directly from Salesforce Composer so let's imagine situation that at the moment we have some chat which is already completed and here we have some chat transcript and uh, our customer requested us to have a possibility to use this transcript as an attachment when we are using standard Salesforce Composer from the feed so how it could be actually done so at the moment we prepared custom uh, LVC components that allowing us to generate necessary file so once the document was generated uh, we could use this attach option from there select necessary uh, PDF file attach it to the email and actually send it and once it's done what we will get at the end is we will get situation when our email is go out and we have attachment to it with all necessary transcript attached so how it's actually organized so let's jump to the code level and let's see what do we have inside of uh, our implementation so we have a case document generator class and here we have some constants like for situation when document was already generated when it was not generated when it's already exist and we don't want to make a duplicate and when some incoming parameters are actually invalid so main entry point of this class it's a function with name create case document based on the transcript what it's getting it's getting case ID because we just placing our component on the case record detail page so in that case we could get a current case ID so we are checking if this uh, not empty then all is good and we continue to work uh, with the class also we setting up default result message and what we are trying to do is we would like to get related transcript for this case so how it could be done we just uh, trying to perform SQL and trying to get only uh, latest created and completed transcript because for the current case there are, could be a multiple transcript attached and at the moment we just decided to use the latest one so that's why we uh, have this order by created uh, desk once at least one related transcript is in exist in the systems and what we're doing it's we returning this transcript to the main function after that we are checking okay if actually there is at least one transcript exist we are checking if uh, document related to this uh, transcript is already exist so what we are doing we just using the count function of the SQL and checking for the any published document with the same document name that we expected to see if there are actually uh, already existing document what we are doing is we just returning status the document is already exist if it's not exist then we just generating content document and how we are doing it is we just preparing content uh, version where we just put in the same transaction name as a title, pass to the client, as PDF file, and uh, as a version data we are using blob function to PDF. And so uh, once it's done, uh, we also insert in content document link and important note here is that content document ID is imp uh, important and required field and you will be able to just access it when you will select the actually inserted record uh, right after the insertion it will not be available if you will try to get it by the reference and we insert in this content document link uh, so once it's done what we are doing is we just generating uh, message to our frontend that everything is okay so how our frontend is actually look here we have just a pretty simple template with one uh, button that allowing us to uh, perform the following action we just invoking our uh, generator class and what we are doing is we just invoke necessary function passing our current record ID for the current page so it will be available if you, you will use the creator API and after that we actually just parsing the result and returning it to the UI so that's how we could see actually this result of operation so when we will try to generate document once more time it will return to us that document already exists and one more time rem reminder for you is that this component is added to the uh, case uh, record detail page so in general the whole so by this way you could do what is requested from business. Thank you.